All right, so what we have here is an LG dishwasher. This is model number. Come on in here. What do we got? It is the LDS 4821ST, right there. So we have a situation where the door falls freely down. I'll just show that again. Falls freely. There's an easy fix for that. So, underneath, bring the camera on down. You'll find you got a couple of points that end up holding your dishwasher in. Uh, we'll just pull these out real quick. Don't worry about the dirty dishes in the dishwasher. We can work with them in there. And, oh, any moment there. All right. We can close the door and we can pull this dishwasher out. So, if we don't, when we have a look down here at the bottom, you see we end up having, we've got a spring that is now attached to you, essentially a string on a pulley coming around. So if we open the door, you can see the spring will stretch and there's a little action going on there with essentially this string with a couple of attachment points. You can see it's how it's a little frayed here. Come on around to this side. You can see where our main problem is. So we end up having our string at this point. It's actually very frayed and down to its last threads. So we're gonna go and replace this portion here. So, or replace the whole piece. So, I'm just gonna close this up. And I'm having a couple of pieces from, that I picked up from Amazon. So, we're just gonna go and replace this piece here. So, spring is going to come off off the top there actually now I'm gonna go and detach it from the bottom because that's a lot easier unhook I end up unhooking it from the bottom here now this piece is now free so free and ready to be replaced hmm, that's interesting this one is so much shorter let's see how it's going to work. So it's actually much shorter than I was expecting. So I'm going to go and take, take one end of this, go and hook it into a nice little slot on the bottom there. And now this will be interesting. Holy moly. That's a, that's a lot more tension on there than I was expecting. So it comes as a two pack, which is a good thing. So I can now go and swap it out, do the other side too, because I always get to repair it or do these at the same time. So I will do the same thing on this side. Unhook from the bottom, keeping the spring intact or keeping the spring in place. Come around, unhook the bottom. And now I have that one done. Go and hook that back on. And sneak it back around through the bottom. Do that extra pull to make sure that it's in, hooked on there. We now have both in place. I should be able to take this door now and have it come down. It does not just fall to the bottom. So there was no trial run beforehand. First time that I saw the, this in action. So I'm very happy with that. I can now go in, essentially close that up and all is good. So I'll go, I'll push this dishwasher back in place. Excuse the noise. Come on. Make sure everything's all lined back up again. And I can pop my screws back in where they need to go.
once you get to this point, you're pretty much done anyways. So, and uh, go. Hang on. Let me fish that one out of there. As you can see, we're not really rehearsed in this case, so we're just doing it. And last one back in there. Come on. Find the hole. Get in there. All right. Door in. We're good. How was that? You happy with that? All right. Good job.